everyone, this is Lovecrafty Girl. Welcome back to my channel. Today we're doing a weekly spread in my happy planner. For this week, I decided to go through my stash of printables where I keep them in a folder. And these are all printables that I've held on to for a while because I can't seem to find the right time to use them. So this week coming up, I figured, you know what? There's nothing special happening this week. There's nothing really that I would want to use that's, you know, brand new. So I thought, let's go to my stash and see what I find. So I found a free printable by Life with Myra, and the printable that I chose is the princess one. Now, I really love this. I mean, there's, you get three pages of so much cool stuff in here, and I love Disney princesses. I just think they're super cute, so I can't wait to use this. Now, the only thing is I have to use a glue stick for this because when I printed this out, I didn't change paper. I forgot that I had regular paper and a sticker paper, and so when I printed it out, it came out on regular paper so it's okay not a big deal there's always a glue stick and I could just go ahead and glue it on so continue watching and see how I put this spread together so I'm gonna start with this um, washi sticker that the printable brought I think it's super cute now this printable is for the happy planner so all the boxes will fit perfectly in their spots this is not an Erin Condren so I tend to always get a little confused because I'm not used to using um, happy planner size printables I'm used to using Erin Condren so um, you'll see a little like moments where I have to like I have like blanks I go back and place something in it and so forth but I'm gonna go ahead and start with the little half boxes here placing a title one on each one now the principal brings these stickers um, that says morning afternoon and evening and I have seen those before in other people's spreads and I've always been curious um, about using them like how would I use it? Would it work for me? Kind of thing. And so this printable brought those. And I thought, okay, cool. I'm going to experiment this time around and see how I feel about it. So I am placing them. Obviously, not all the boxes will go are going to have these stickers. Um, but I am going to use them in most of them that are um, blank. And then um, after this week, hopefully, um, as I do my uh, planning for the week I want to see how it works for me like does it really work for me or is it something that just doesn't work you know because I knew I never use anything like that so I don't know it's gonna be new for me which I like and I want to see and if I like it I might want to you know get into finding more of those kind of stickers for future spreads especially for the blank um, boxes that I usually have to always put something in there I thought it'd be kind of nice to add one of those in case I don't have um, the appropriate sticker to go with the spread itself so we'll see how that goes for this week now I'm gonna go ahead and do things a little different um, usually the uh, big blank uh, square boxes you see that I use on the column usually I use them at the bottom but this time around I use the half boxes because this principle is three pages there's so much stuff to use I want to use as much as of it I can because I can't always save everything um, but I also um, if I could use most of it why not right so I ended up just using them for the column I ended up using stickers in different places that I'm not used to and I thought you know what it's always nice to try something new um, feel the difference and see what works what doesn't work and then go from there but I'm gonna see how that goes for this week now I'm on the second page I'm gonna do the exact same thing also one thing I if you haven't noticed no washi tape in these two pages I didn't use any washi tape um, because again using this um, happy planner uh printable there's not much space for washi tape um and i think that's probably why i'm loving more of the erin condren because it gives me the excuse to use a lot of my washi tapes and now with this i noticed that there's not much i can do with it so i am not covering any of those yellow lines i'm not covering anything because pretty much this printable is going to do a lot of it for me and also those yellow lines um went well with this printable as well so i'm just going to go ahead and continue decorating my page my pages and um from there we will just um add the numbers to the boxes because the printable does bring the numbers to um put into your um date boxes which is great and i'm going to Go ahead and do that and then i'll be done
So here's the file to put together this weekly spread. It came out really, really nice. I like the colors and images. I think it was fun to put together. A little time consuming since I had to glue each one of these pieces down. But overall though, I love it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. Don't forget to subscribe and don't forget to give me a thumbs up. And I'll see you guys next time.